Hello, my name is Jay. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a simple box plot chart in Python. So over here I have the uh, blank empty Python script. And so let me show you the data set that we'll be using. And over here I have a, a bike sharing.csv file. And I'll download this file from the uh, governmental website. I sent this the, the data for one of the bike sharing program in Washington, DC from 2011 all, all the way to uh, end of 2012 and so let's take a look at the columns so we have the the instant columns the instance basically just the the primary key and dates and here we have the the season and under the season column we have a uh, number from one to four so let me apply the other filter and one is winter, two is a spring, and three is summer, and four is fall. So if we take a look at uh, three, so the months that fell into uh, season three, and this are pretty much an in, uh, indication that uh, this are during the summer season. And year, so year, the program starting from 2011, so in 2011, it's using the uh, start the year of zero. So that means that it's the beginning of the year. And if we scroll to 2012, and we get a uh, one. So that means that it's the first year after the program. So this one. And month's pretty easy. So January to uh, December. And holiday. So zero basically means it's not a holiday. And what means it's a holiday? I don't think this is accurate, but we'll, we'll not be using this column anyway. And the weekdays, so basically, from uh, it's an indication that which of weekdays uh, this day fell on to. And working day, so zero means it's not a working day, and one means it's a normal regular working day. And weatherless, so this one. Uh, I forgot the uh, the translation, but I think that one means uh it's a clear day, and two means cloudy, and three means windy. And I think that's the the translation. But we'll mainly be using the the month column and casual or register. So one of the other. <clears throat> the name in casual column means that for these dates. How many people uh, rented the bike? So on January 1st, 2011, 331 people or someone who is not registered, uh, this is the number of the people that rent the bike. And among the registered users, and 654 uh, people has rented the, the bike on January 1st. Let me open my uh, Python script. And first, I'm going to import my module. So the map plots live.py plots as uh, plt. And this is the, the module that will be using mainly to uh, plot the, the box plot chart. And as well as the, the seaborne uh, plots. So I'm going to rename this as uh, SNS. And as well as the pandas module to read the, the CSC file. So I was just meaning importing the CSV uh, method. <clears throat> so I'm going to start out uh, read the, the CSV file into a data frame uh, variable. So let me just grab the CSV file name. And now if I just do a uh, print, so print the data frame variable. And we get uh, 731 rows in 11 columns. We don't really need all the columns, so uh, to nail down the, the data set, I'm going to just grab the, the columns that we need. So we need uh, the months, and maybe year. We we'll also need uh, the year. And so we we'll also grab the casual and register. So we we'll just plot. Uh, 
these two columns uh, one by one, just do a, a quick comparison. And now if I uh, save and uh, run, now we only get uh, these four columns from our data frame variable. So I'm going to plot the, the box plot chart uh, based on the months, but I don't want to uh, plot every single month and there'll be too many in one uh, window. So I'm, I'm just only going to uh, filter the months by from January to March. And to do that, so first I'm going to uh, use the, the is in function and so from the the months column, I only want the the January, February, and March uh, data sets, and as well as uh, only the year in two thousand eleven. And here's our uh, uh, condition. So, and now I just need to apply the the condition to our uh, data frame variable. Okay. Now, if I just print these, oops, uh, there's a typo somewhere. Let me check. Oh, I see. So it's the one at the top. I forgot the the square bracket. And now, if I just uh, print reprint the data set again. Okay, so sorry. And this time I'm not getting any uh, error. And I'm only getting the, the data set from uh, year first, so which, which is 2011, and for the months of uh, January all the way to, to March. Okay, now we have the, the data set that we need. Now we can go ahead and uh, plot the box plot chart. So I'm going to start with uh, assign the creating the x variable. So this will be months and y variable. So I'm going to uh, pl plot the, the the number of the casual column. And I'm going to set the size seven by seven. And we'll plot the, the data. So assign the variable x. And we'll use the SNS class to, and from the class there's a, a method called box plot method. And so we have a couple uh, parameters, x, y, and hue data and a couple others. And since this is gonna be a very simple box plot chart, so we'll let's apply the y, x and y. as well as the, the data will be on the, from the data frame. And the POT that shows is going to basically um, display the, 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 the chart window. And this is basically it. So if I just save and run, and now we get the, the very simple looking box plot chart. And now if I want to uh, display all the, the, the points, and I can use the, the jitter. And there's a, a swarm plot uh, method. And the, uh, the parameter is basically the same. Data equals to df. And except that this time I want to, I don't want to use the same color as the uh, box plot chart. And I want to use the color gray and to for the, the <clears throat> for all the data series. Now if I just save and run this again. And this is the, the final final result. So we have the, the box plot chart for uh, January, uh, February and March. And so these are the outliers right here. And so from here you can see that uh, for generally, there's not much of uh, traffic when it comes to uh, bike renting for uh, casual users. 
and now if I uh, change the parameter to uh, registered and just save around this and we can match a uh, different uh, result set so you see that uh, the traffic is much higher you know, there's uh, a lot more people in January and February and March compared to the casual users so yeah so just very uh, simple tutorial showing you how to quickly uh, plot the box plot chart using Python.